All right, so uh, as some of you are probably doing right now, you might be looking at Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I just started playing it yesterday, and I'm slowly getting the hang of it. But of course, as the Archery channel, uh, my focus in enjoying and playing this game is to examine the Archery side for the upcoming uh, Archery Pop Shots episode. I've done this for uh, Origins and Odyssey, um, and of course, Valhalla it makes sense you want to cover uh, Viking or Norse archery, but I know this is a fantasy game. It's historical fantasy. It's fun when you think about it that way But what the hell is wrong with the bows in this game? Right, so firstly I have this but the Spartan bow that's a uh, unlockable uh, content That's not part of the game, but it is in the game. We start with this bow. This is a Hunnish bow Definitely not a Hunnish bow, although it is based on a real bow design in real life, that's fine. And you have this very really fantastical uh, re recurve bow. But I, I really gotta talk about, what the hell's wrong with this? Uh, look at this, I mean, I, I thought this was... Like, when you have this, it appears on your back and you think, Oh yeah, it's probably like being carried on your back, running strung across your chest. So I kind of get why... They might not do that for the sake of not having too much clipping on the character model. But why is it that in the menu screen, when you equip it, the string is there? Why is the string like right there? I mean, it's a physical impossibility for one, but like there, ha there has to be a visual glitch, uh, which says a lot about the state of the game on a release. But like, what? Why it looks so dumb? And then you have same thing over here. Like it is. The string is here. There has to be a coding error. But the, the biggest and most egregious area is this. This is the a recurve bow. Let's say see a recurve bow. Now a recurve bow, this is a recurve bow. See the limbs bend away and bend back. That's a recurve bow. Even this is a recurve bow. This is a freaking straight stick. It's a wooden stick with metal plates on it. How is this a bow? This does not make a single bit of sense. Like, like, how do you even pull the string back? The only way this actually works is if you have an elastic band. Uh, the, the more you look at it, the worse it gets. Because the strings attached to these metal eyelets. Like, how does it... Uh, how is it meant to bend? Because all the, all the parts which are meant to flex on a bow, are covered in metal. What is this? I mean, that brace height, like, you can't even pull the string back. So, like, again, I know Assassin's Creed is uh, famous for being a fantasy game. I, I love Assassin's Creed, but, like, no Assassin's Creed game has had a bow this bad. No video game has had a bow this bad. So, I don't know whether the rest of these things are visual glitches because when you when you hold onto them in real in the game, they, they look fine, okay? So, let's let's on a shot. You can see, oops. Um you can see that the string is fine, okay? So, that at least does look and function like a real bow. And, and it is a real bow, a bit decorated with the middle parts, but it is a real bow. But when you have when you have this like, how? I mean, how? I, I don't mind the fact there's an iron sight on here. That makes that makes no sense. But that that's that's that, that's the predator bow. But why does it look like this? Why does the bow look like this? It's a it's a metal rod. That is not a bow. That is absolutely ridiculous. There is no way that this bow would ever function in real life. Sorry, I know you might like the game, and to be fair, it is just one part of the game. There's the rest of it, which is pretty fun. But uh, in terms of bow design, designers, what what were you thinking? What is this? Anyway, uh, if you've been playing the game, <laughs> let me know what you think of it so far. But uh, I think this is um, far to say one of the uh, worst bows I've ever seen in a video game.